This him? Yeah. He's the one who hit me, robbed me, and burned down my store. Damn it, Petey. This is not gonna work. God, why won't anyone listen to me? All I took was the beer. This is Officer Ryan. No, no, you you can't do this to me. Uh, uh, you have no proof. Look at me, kid. These days, the law is all about judgments. Doesn't have a place in this world. Show them what? That behind this door, I've got the number one theft, assault, arson, and underage drinking case that this state has ever seen. I'm gonna show them Max. You're going to stay with your aunt and uncle. Why? We were just there for the funeral. Oh, come on, let's go. But Dad! Max! I need you to do what I ask. What do you want from me? I don't know. Just please come with me. You can't do this. She was my mom. And you're my dad. You're right. Of your dad. She's gone now, and you can't bring her back. But I'm still here, and she was a part of me. How much? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna need to see an ID. I don't have one. Get out then. N no, I mean, I, I don't have one with me. I said, get out. Look, what does it matter? Either way, you're still getting paid. It matters whether you're under 21 or not. Hey, put the beer down or I'm gonna call the cops. Put the beer down. Good. Now walk away, high school. Oh! Oh! Mm. Oh, you're gonna get health for this, kid. Stop! You need time. 
Mr. Vance, you don't understand. I need more time. I can't finish the project by Friday. Fifteen more days, Cameron. Fifteen more days. And then it will be summer. And I will be in Europe. I know. I just need more time. Please, give me until Wednesday. I know I can finish the film. Ambition doesn't suit you, Cameron. Trying to save your grade with a 15-minute movie will never work. I'd be less concerned with your fate if you hadn't chosen to work with one of my best students. Who? Rachel? I will not stand by idly and watch as you ruin her future. She chose to work with me. I'm going to finish this project, I promise you. <laughs> you will drag her down, Cameron, just like a rock. And then you will be responsible for depriving the world of its next intellectual savior. The film. Kim, you've got to stop calling me. I'm still doing the rewrites. I just had a dream about Mr. Vance and the project. Good. I'm glad you've been thinking about it. Look, I think we're in trouble. I don't think the whole Toby stand-in thing is going to work. Okay. Do you know where Max is? I literally have no idea, Cameron. You're the producer. Yeah, I'm aware of that, which is why I'm trying to find him. Hold on, there's someone on the other line. Never mind. I don't know the number. Uh, tell me about the rewrites. Alright, would you tell me who he is? Doesn't matter. You're welcome, though. We're saving you back there. Saving us? You didn't save us, you screwed us. Because of you, we're gonna have to be on the run for the rest of our lives. You knocked out a police officer. I mean, this is the police we're dealing with. Look, there was, there was four cops there. One was an intern, two didn't even see us. I, I wiped the tapes. If it makes you feel any better, they'll be so busy looking for me, they'll forget all about you kids. Linda's on the way over, she can give us a ride home. Home? No, no, not, not, not home. I can't, I can't go home. We have to go somewhere else first. Where? Wait, where did Kyle and Rachel go? The hospital. I have to go to the hospital. I, I have to see my dad before, b b before he, uh. Yeah. Linda's here. Come on, we'll go. Wait, so we're running, but where are we running to? I haven't got a clue, Petey. But I thought I'd check out the old cabin. Either way, expect a call from me. Hey, what? Come on, come on, let's just go. No, not you. Look, you let a convict out of his cell. And he hurt an officer. Come on. But, but... He's my uncle. Where's Kyle? Oh, I helped him find his briefcase. He felt really icky. So I let him go back to my house to take a shower. How's he doing? You want us to go in with you? Hello, Max. You're fine. Just stay with him. Max. Dad, Dad, you need a rest. It's really okay. Just no, there's, rest. there's something I need to tell you. 
Um, after, after your mom died, it was hard for us. Oh, yeah, yeah. Especially for you. I, I was lost. She'd always been there. And then, and then I was alone, and I, I didn't know how. I didn't, I didn't know how. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. I'm sorry for the life you should have had. Oh, for the life I should have no, given you. No. For the what you deserved. No, I, I'm I, sorry. I wouldn't want to go back. Even if I could, it just, it, it wouldn't be me. It, it wouldn't be us. Are you there? Well, a uh, sandwich would be nice, if you could find the time. I'm at the cabin. Uh, when can you get here? No, no, no. You listen to me, Petey. You, you better get out here right now or else I'll... Hello? Petey? Petey? Peter says goodbye. Cousins and one new watch A chauffeur-driven dream Told us where to drop All of our feelings there in the porch So no one could avoid So no one could avoid Hold on Maybe. 
me you'll understand I look into your eyes You don't know who I am Did you scream it? Honey from the ground Well my day just got listed And the purple's talking down Meetings in the desert We wanted to hear about We wanted to hear Cut!